I am yet 4455 and welcome back to Let's Try Banished. So on the last episode, uh, our town was hit by a massive, massive uh, food shortage and a lot of people died. I'm going to guess that number to be probably around 40 people. So yeah, we're not doing too great. Um, it is now winter and you can see our food is at 65 again. So yeah, not good. Um, but I think most of our working slots are full, except for Forest Servant. That's fine. We'll slowly get that back up. Um, but yeah, we took a hard hit, to say the least. Yeah, but we definitely have the capacity to, for more people, just, you know, everyone died. Which is unfortunate. See, I'm almost thinking this market night might not be the best place. How many tools do I have? Only 33. Right, we won't go any tools. Um, but the good news is I do have another cornfield over here. So we got wheat, we got corn, and we have apples, which hopefully will be harvested this year. Right. So we will see. I'm trying to get all my farms in one place. But it is tough. Do 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 do. There we are. Right. So yeah, we just gotta wait around, see if we can get in. Oh, hello. God, I hate how that does that. Every time I try to bring up the uh, Twitch app, it just blasts the volume. All right, I think we still have, we're, think we're still pretty good on logs. And we are. At least for the most part. Um, I'm going to drop a builder in favor of a laborer. What am I short of? Firewood. But we got three woodcutters. Well, that should be plenty to get some to get enough wood. Right. Make sure everything sounds good. Looks good. All right. Is it almost what is it almost spring? I see all the snow is melted. Early spring, so it should be about planting time. And it looks like I lost another worker somewhere, probably to old age. That house is rebuilt. Good. Right. It was unfortunate, but I had to cut all the students out. But I have 22 kids, though, so at least the next generation is still pretty strong. Oh, we gotta fight this hunger. That would be nice if I'd get traders that could bring me more livestock. So I think I got enough. Eh, we'll drop that. Eh, we'll leave it. Right. So yeah, food is hard to keep hold of. Keep on top of. I mean, luckily I have hunters and fishermen and stuff, and I think I might I think building maybe building another fishing hut. Another fishing dock. I think that would actually be very helpful. Yeah, so we're gonna do that. Well, we need population, of course. Now they keep saying something about nomads, but I've yet to see a nomad. I don't know if something you turn on. 
mean, I have the boarding house, so there's no reason I shouldn't be getting any nomads, but I don't. I think one builder is good for now, just so I can have that labor around. In case I need to move people around. But yeah, I got plenty of farmers now. And I see my vineyard is doing good. And it is growing this year, so we will get some apples. That's good. Where am I low on again? Firewood. It's spring. It's 56 degrees. I think you could deal without the firewood for a little bit. Get stocked up there. Do have a lot of stone and iron. And I'm starting to lose my number of wood. Which is fine. Right. So I was going to do another fishing dock. So let's go ahead and do that. Fishing dock. Um, do I want to move it away from the other one, though? You know, it's fine. I think it'll be fine. Just these stone and logs, of which I have plenty. I just wish the school didn't take so long to teach up these kids. I got plenty of kids, just, you know. I need them in the working population. But some things help, can't be helped, I guess. Still complaining about firewood. See, like, 78 venison. Share that with people. You don't need 78 venison meat. I mean, I'm sure that might be part of the problem is they don't share. And as I lose another worker, probably to death. Uh, where did they come from? I'm losing a builder. Who died? Possibly a trader, but I think that'd be all right. Oh, no, I lost my labor. Okay. Was getting stuff to the dockyard really that strenuous? Really? Well, at least you got all your stuff there before you croaked. So I'll take it. They're still planting. Surprisingly. I do need to get houses out here though, I feel. The fishing dock is almost complete. It doesn't bother me too much that they're next to each other. I think that would actually help. So then I could always take a couple people I don't need yet. So I think what I might do, I don't really need that much more iron and wood. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one each from there. Uh, I'm going to need the miner more than the stone cutter. And then I'll put them into this new fishing hut. I can't have more fishermen though. Right. Um. Okay, they spread out. So I'm just going to make them fishermen. Perfect. 
So then I got six fishermen, which should really help with at least some of the food, because I think fish, I think fishermen get their stock faster than uh. than the uh, hunters. And I got another trader. Please have livestock. I need livestock. That would solve most, if not all, of my issues. What do you got for trade? Apples? Okay. Um, we are going to trade for this. We have cabbage seeds. I don't need plum seeds, and we'll trade for this. So a thousand. Trading the firewood. Give me four hundred. Right. Uh, I could trade the tools, which I will. Um, let's go sixty. I think. All right, still not enough. We'll go uh, 75. Perfect thousand. Great. All right, then I need to drop my tools so that they don't steal them all. Yeah, we'll go with 40. I think I have enough tools for that. Let me see. Yes, I do. In fact, I could just up that. Um... No, we'll, we'll keep it there. Right. All right, then you have squash, but I think I'm going to hold off on that. Though I do have a lot of ale, but no way to really trade it. And I got to keep something for livestock. So yeah, I think I'm going to hold off on that. But yeah, I got a thousand units and already the food is just, it's gone. Alright, trader. It's been a pleasure, but goodbye. Yeah, I mean, it's already, it's already down to 95. It's ridiculously how fast that food goes. And there's... Still people that are complaining that they don't have any. While your neighbor will probably be sitting on a hundred units. Uh, not so much. Okay, I have 17 students now. I mean, we're, we're battling. We're, we're trying to keep up with that. I don't think I have any food in my inventories anymore. Do you have ale? Do I have enough herbs? I think I do. 103. Um, yeah, we're gonna up the herbs here to 200. So I could use some and trade. Uh, we're holding steady at about 100 food, so I think come harvest I think we're gonna be all right I'm hoping we're gonna be all right how's everything going here uh, we already started harvesting some corn so that's good um, it's just a shame I don't have any labors So I don't know if anything's getting delivered, you know? So hopefully. But no, we definitely, definitely have a, uh, have harvest coming. There's more and more food get dropped off. Hopefully I get enough stores for winter. Yeah, we're holding it 
five, four, over 500 now. Uh, we got plenty of, got a ton of firewood now. Um, the stores are filling up. Mushrooms, corn. Good, good. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Are they dropping any food off here? Yes, wheat. Um, looks like they're starting to pick some apples. And people are saying they're hungry. I have food. Get it. Get food. Like, I have plenty of food now, people. There's no reason why anyone should be going hungry now. No reason. Right, how am I doing in everything else? I uh, got the herbs up, firewood's back up to 100. Tools are slacking, but I'm at 42, so I gotta keep that where that's at. I do not have enough jackets to fill that anymore. Unfortunately. That's why sheep would be nice, because then I can make wool coats. It's autumn. Only a thousand food. I'm not storing it like I should. Like I used to. Right? There's food. Go grab some. Like, you could do it. It's alright. Someone else died. Great. I don't think it was because of starvation, though. Um, it looks like I lost a miner. I can't really take anybody from anywhere else. I mean, unless I just turn all eight of these kids to workers. I wish I could just, like, select one. Like, hey, I need two workers. Two of the students are going to do that. That's what I need. It's still autumn. All right, you guys better start getting this corn though before it all starts dying. I mean, I, I feel like I feel like half of the food I'm just losing because they're not picking it. Like, look at this. It, I just drop. I, I'm losing the entire yield. I think that's what happened. They're just not. You know, I, I feel like they're not picking it in time, and I just lost the yield. You know. You know, but that's a nice chunk of corn there. So I might just have made it for winter. You know, I got plenty of chickens, so they should be working at eggs. And I do get chicken eventually, occasionally. Um, there's plenty of food there. I don't know. We'll see. I'm hoping there's enough food. Firewood is low, of course. How am, how am I doing on logs? 23. Are you kidding me? Ouch. And I'm down to 59 workers. I lost the farmer. Which is not good. Not good at all. Done the 17 pieces of wood. I uh, will throw another 20 iron tools in here. <coughs> Alright, I'll, yeah, I'll, hopefully they'll get schooled up during winter. Because I'm, I need, uh, I need workers. They're just, they're starting to get old and I'm starting to have to go through the next stock. It's almost like the school's not worth it at this point. You know? Because I got 10 students in there that would be a huge boon to my workforce. So yeah, since it's winter, you know, there's, there's not much work to be done. I think I'll leave them in school for now. Uh, food reserves are doing alright, but you know, you gotta keep in mind it has to last a year. So we're a long way from those days where I would have, you know, 5,000, 7,000 excess food stored up. Those days are long gone. All 
but I don't get you know it, it, it was like I, I just sit there and watch the entire crop just die off because they didn't pick it in time you know like I have the number of workers it's saying I need for them and they just didn't didn't do it didn't get them in time all right I'm gonna drop one for a laborer for now that will drop to come spring we'll bump that number back up just so we can kind of keep it a little bit organized yeah my graveyard definitely filled up fast You know, you know, that's not a bad idea. You know, in, in winter, the farmers are worthless. They really are. So, like, in this, this is the time where I can take all these farmers and put them in the jobs. Into all their jobs. And then just come, uh... You know, come, come a spring, I just take them out of those jobs and put them back to being farmers. Yeah, I, I like that. I like that. This way I can keep up with the food. What is this? Firewood. You know, I could still keep up with the food. In winter, we use to stockpile other things. Right. And so I do want this window there. Just so I could always keep it up so I can kind of keep an eye on it on things. Gets a little annoying, but you know, it's better than having to close it. This way I could do that one at my leisure. Right. Um Stored medicine. What is that? Stored textiles, which I think is like wool and leather and stuff. So yeah, once early spring hits. Yeah, I mean, we're holding steady on the food now. I mean, we're holding steady. I don't think they've... I think they're able to restock their homes. And that's just reserve. And since I have so many extra things, you know, I got eight hunters, eight fishermen now. I think they're able to keep that reserve steady as people take from it. Which is what we need. Now it's hard to tell what I have stockpiles of exactly because nothing's in a centralized place. I mean, this place just kind of takes willy nilly from everything. Um, there's not a lot in my barns, surprisingly. And yet it's saying I have a lot of food, so maybe there, maybe it's all over here. Well, I at least have 560 corn. Now, what happened to all my apples? I mean, I got 40 there. Got a bunch of wheat, corn. Okay, yeah, it's all here. Most of it's in the trader. I guess they went through all those apples. Now, I think next year... Um, I'm down to 15 logs, which is scary. Because I, I was at over 200 before that happened. And I think a lot of it has to do with I cleared a lot. Um... But I still have a lot of... For I still have eight foresters. I didn't take any foresters because I always need logs. I always need wood. So that's fine. Alright, we're in late winter. Alright, I took them from f two fishermen and uh, foresters. I did take four foresters. Okay. So that's what, well, actually, I think I'm going to take it from hunters. Hunters don't really do that much for me. And I, I think fishermen are, would be the better choice. So I'll take them from hunters. Yeah, we'll take them from the hunting camp. And the forester camp.
Then we'll throw them right back in the farmers as spring hits. Then I think in summer we'll take two, put them back in hunters. So yeah, we're at, we're at two thousand food now. I think we're I think we hit the end of that. It has to be almost spring now. Late winter. Still late winter. And the temperature seems to be building steadily now. Yeah, I want to say we're at the end of that. Which is, you know, which is great. Mm -hmm. Now, so far, no one has died from being too cold, so that's a plus. I think I'm barely, I'm just about at the edge of being stable with the, uh, with the firewood. Oh, yeah, and I took them as laborers. Okay. That's right. That's right. Yeah, so, yeah, it was year 28. I mean, this year wasn't a bad year. Last year was terrible. This one, it could have been better, but you know what? We're doing all right. So, I mean, the health dropped a little bit, which is fine. The happiness dropped just a touch, but remember, we're recovering from losing 40-plus town members. So, I, I think, think it's fine. Early spring, all right. Let me go ahead and pause that. Let me get the... I was taking them as hunters. Just two. And four foresters. And then I was just going to throw them all. Back in the farmers. Right. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to be putting in a pause right here. If you guys like what you watch, please consider subscribing if you haven't already. And don't forget to check me out over at Patreon. Support what I'm doing over there. And don't forget to uh, like me and uh, follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Keep up to date with all the latest info over there. So I am Yet4455. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.